Hi, I'm Terry Jones. I um, lead talent and development uh, for Palo Alto Networks across EMEA, JPAC, that's Japan, Asia Pacific and Latin America. You know, everybody's obviously been through a very you know, again, unique but interesting um, and very personal experience in the last couple of years. Being in Monday to Friday, I think, has gone forever. Um, and, and actually, I think that that sort of differs slightly depending on where you are. That's why having this sort of baseline um, sort of platform around and philosophy around flex work, I think, becomes even more important. So, uh, you know, so you've got to be able to uh, assess based on where, where people are on the journey. But, but philosophically, look, I think... Um, the office has a, a massive part to play. I think uh, we, it needs to differentiate from what it is that people are doing at home. Um, and some of those things can be those sort of serendipitous coffee moments, you know, which, uh, which you just don't get on Zoom. Zoom meetings tend to be a bit more structured. Um, you know, you do have the, the, the nice sort of uh, uh, initial couple of questions to warm up in, in the Zoom, but then you sort of go into the business meeting. So you do miss out on, on some of that engagement. So we've got to make the offices different. That's the bottom line. And so, um, you know, I think the office then becomes really important for things like ide ideation, collaboration, team meetings, um, particularly customer centricity. So if you're in a customer focused role, of course, you know, and the customers want that from you. I think that's really key. Um, I think there's also an element of, of well-being, frankly, um, in amongst all of this. And I'm seeing huge reaction from teams and huge desire for people to get back together, particularly, you know, in, in training situations. So I think you've got to create a, a workspace that's inviting, that's different, um, that, you know, covers all those things that I've, I've talked about and sort of promotes that. And I think by being in an office and feeling that culture so that doesn't get diluted, I think you feel part of something a bit bigger and, uh, you know, something a little bit more tangible than perhaps what you can get on Zoom um, and a little bit deeper in terms of the uh, sort of emotional intelligence level that you possibly don't get through Zoom as well. Mm -hmm.